We're gonna try something a little bit different today. I'm working on the event with Our Wyoming Life with Mike Galloway. I had to run out here to the Beckhart production facility and pick up some wire and uh, some samples of different products that we're gonna use up at Mike's in the next uh, couple of weeks. We keep uh, quite a bit of product on stock. Uh, there's a lot of US steel here. Getting ready to head out here, uh, Kansas City, on day two of my journey to Ranch Roundup. Keith and Stephen's Great Western Adventure begins. So we finally made it. We're out at the ranch in Wyoming. Uh, what we thought we'd do right now is kind of show you some of the stuff that we're going to be using. Um, definitely the premier is going to be the 14 gauge Cattleman barbed wire. So you get a lighter gauge with a higher tensile strength and you get a stronger fence. So all you do is rotate your puller around and then slide it over the top of the wire and rotate. That's pretty tight. So all we do is we take that clip and that, that chuck has a little hole in the end of it. And all we do, and we're done. We're gonna go down the hill, cross the valley over here, and tie into another fence that Mike has out. Uh, this cattleman barbed wire ought to do really great on this pool. Steve and I have got the uh, corner set. We've got the line posts in. Mike and them are in drought, so we've moved up to a rig-mounted uh, 1,000 HP. Yeah, um, definitely like a new uh, post driver. Quick, easy, first brace built, second one's about to be finished, and run some wire and we're good to go for a day. The, uh, the Cattleman 14 gauge from Beckhart, I mean, it stretched up tight, gave us a really good line, but it, it looks good. I think Mike's gonna be really happy. We've just finished up our build with Mike Galloway from Our Wyoming Life. Uh, the crowd has just left us. A uh, bunch of ranchers, farmers, uh, and subscribers to the Our Wyoming Life channel came out and we demoed for them this morning. So the methane pipe that Mike, that, uh, Mike had here on the ranch were about 31, almost 32 feet. So we cut it three sticks. The rest of it's in the ground. So we're five and a half to six foot deep. So that should get us down below the frost line. It should help us stop with any heaving in the, in the spring, start trying to lever out. Plus we've got a good diagonal to stop that. Two, four, six, eight, 10. And squeeze that together a little bit so you get the chuck on it. Push it in like that. And you're done. We thought we'd just flip around here and show you guys how good the Cattleman barbed wire has done for us this week. It's worked really well for us and followed the terrain well, tensioned up nicely, and uh, they're going to have a fence they're proud of for years. Everything looks good. Runs down the hill and across. All right, guys, remember Beckart, made in the USA.